welcome to North London guys we are in Stock Newington and uh, right now I'm in the middle of Newington Green in Stock Newington it's a little park you can see It's a Thursday evening, about 4 p.m. right now, and the uh, sun is going down. Anyway, it's stuck Newington, Newington Green right now, right here. Normally during summertime, these are uh, jazz festivals every summer around July, and uh, I've attended about in the past three, three years. You know, I'm not a huge you know fan of jazz music but uh, i like live music so every summer the last three summers i've been attending jazz festivals here in newington green so if you're a fan of uh, jazz music you may want to check it out when you're in london yeah it's usually in july so I don't know the dates for this year's, but um, yeah, in July, that's when it always, it, it always is. Yeah, Newington Green, I'm gonna walk around, stop Newington, a few places and show you around. And uh, yeah, hopefully I'll get to Church Street from here. Church Street is not very far from here. And uh, it's one of the um, popular streets in North London, in Stock Newington. It's been growing and developing rapidly and uh, becoming very trendy, you know, every day. It's becoming more and more trendy Church Street and Stock Newington in general. So this road I'm walking on right now is called Green Lane and uh, it starts from uh, the uh, Newington Green all the way to Clissold Park in front of me there and it's uh, from around there at, at a junction not far from here where Church Street is and yeah i'm gonna hopefully walk the entire end of church street to stop newington high street which is a buzzing busy place full of restaurants cafes shops uh, theater cinemas you know, all the lively things that you would expect in a uh, high street. But like I mentioned earlier, it is getting more and more trendy and attracting more businesses and uh, more people. So welcome to Stocky. <laughs> Stocky, that's a slang for Stock Newington. Yeah, what you immediately note when you get to this area of North London around Stock Newington, it's like plenty and plenty of off licenses everywhere. You know, 
Look. Yeah, dress up there. So here we are at the beginning of Church Street and uh, right over there across is the Clisso Park and the uh, famous Clisso Park Tavern over here so on a nice summer day you come up, bring the kids out or something, play in the park and then uh, go and sit down in the tavern, have a drink, pub lunch or something like that. It looks empty at the moment, there are plenty of seats outside but nobody there. But you know, it's 4pm so I suppose people have had their lunch and things but usually summertime there will be plenty of people enjoying themselves in the park. So I'm going to do a quick walk in the park and uh, actually let me walk this way. I'll get to the park, inside the park in a bit. But yeah, so right here is the uh, church street, is it? Here it is, and the church is actually right there in front of us. That tall building piercing through the sky. That's the church, and I think that's why uh, this place is called Church Street because when you walk down the street, you get to the church. Yeah, one thing about most of these churches built around uh, in this country they always have that sort of uh, architecture uh, always taller than the other buildings in the area uh, so people can see the church from a long distance that's why you see it there like that but churches aren't really popular these days in the UK or the western world really or should I say Europe but anyway yeah churches aren't that popular these days most churches are closed turned into pubs oh <laughs> shops or whatever yeah because people simply don't go to church these days in this country so yeah, they're using the building for other things. <laughs> so this right here is a Clissold Park. It's a huge park. And uh, yeah, it's always full as well. It's so, so big and it goes all the way to towards uh, Abney Park Cemetery which if we do walk till the end of this street we'll get to Abney Park Cemetery yeah so here we are at the entrance of the Clayshall Park from this side of the street So big, I can't even walk it right now. It's got lots of different sections, but yeah, it's huge. Goes all the way down there and all the way back there. And uh, yeah, lots of playgrounds, areas. So yeah. Over there, that is the church. We are right here at the church. I'm loving the spring. The flowers are coming back up on the trees. It's feeling nice, it's sunny. 
and uh, yeah so we're gonna go to the other side of the church street walk it all the way to the end Uh, speaking of Abney Park Cemetery I'm gonna tell you a little history about Abney Park Cemetery in the 1800s the population of London City had grown so so much and there wasn't enough place to bury people for burial so the Parliament passed a bill for private cemeteries to be built within 10 years and by 1832 about seven of them were built and they were called the Magnificent Seven Cemeteries and Abney Park is uh, one of them <laughs> plenty of famous people, notables, celebrities, uh, have been buried in uh, Abney Park Cemetery. So this church here is the uh, St. Mary's Old Church, Stock Newington. Plenty of pubs, shops, cafes. Yeah, so this is Church Street. Um, going down there is the um, Abney Road. Behind me on this other side, this is the uh, Stop Newington Town Hall. Yeah. I'm gonna go over to this side to check out some of these properties here. Properties in North London is getting more and more expensive. You know, if you wanna buy properties here, <laughs> You're looking to spend millions. Look at that. Yeah, properties around areas of North London is becoming so unbelievably expensive and unaffordable. <laughs> I wonder which people buy these properties these days. Oh, obviously not, you know ordinary people, just business people buying them and uh, making money, that's it. Right. It's so, so expensive to own properties, houses in London these days. Everything is expensive. Mortgage, a lot of people are remortgaging their houses. The price of uh, mortgages went so high and uh, some people had to, you know, had their houses repossessed and everything. Things aren't going really very well in London at the moment. Nice little pub here, the Red Lion. Hello. It's 
the popo. Well, that's not a good sign, is it? Well, I don't know if that's a good sign or not. When there's police around. I actually saw some policemen in the park as well. So that's probably not a good sign for Stock Newington. Uh, I'm not sure if this place is dangerous or not. Stock Newington. <laughs> but uh, yeah, usually when you see lots of policemen and stuff like that, that suggests obviously that uh, it's probably not a very nice area. Stocky wines. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Is a stock Newington a dangerous area? Uh, no. No? no. Okay. So, yeah, this gentleman says uh, stock Newington is not a dangerous area. Well, yeah, it seems kind of uh, quiet and chilled. See another pub right here behind me, the Clarence. Um, little shops here and there along the streets. So I'm gonna go into the cemetery for a bit, not to do anything, just to um, check it out. Yeah, so this is Abney Park Cemetery that I mentioned earlier. Just off Church Street, Tan and boom, you are in. There are all those people walking around the cemetery, you know. Yeah, lots and lots of uh, very famous people have been uh, buried here. Uh, I don't actually if there's still new barriers like taking place around look who that is there William Booth founder and first general of the Salvation Army born in 1829 born again of the spirit 1845 Right, okay, so uh, I'm gonna walk out. It's all right. You alright? Yeah, is that the new one? Um, no, this is two, pocket two. Ah, is it good? Yeah, man, it's lovely. Yeah? Yeah. It's all natural. Oh, shit, that's sick! <laughs> yeah, man. How much was it? Uh, this one? this was about 540. Mm. But it's a combo with everything. You know, yeah, it's got yeah, lots yeah, yeah. Separate microphone, you know, this uh, wide angle lens. Yeah. So it's like a whole thing. Very sick. Yeah, this Very is detachable sick. as well. Yeah, so yeah. yeah. If you need vlogging <laughs> or something, it's the absolute kit you need. Amazing. Yeah. <laughs> Nicely done, man. Yeah, man. See ya. <laughs> right. So, yeah.
here we are back on the streets church street i walked all the way from there and now we're gonna carry on to the end of the street uh, this street meets uh, Stock Newington High Street and I think I'll end this vlog when we get there I'm not so sure but uh, I think so there's a nice pub right at the corner so I'm thinking of uh, going and grabbing <laughs> a pint or so beginning to the end of this trip. Look at that. Hairdressers, nail technicians, florists, little this and that. So that's the three crowns there very nice pub always uh, nice music as well live music there and right here is where church street ends If you go that direction there, you get to Stamford Hill uh, and over to Seven Sisters and Tottenham. And you go this way, you get to Dalston and towards the city of London. See? So this right here is the busier area of Stock Newington. Uh, this is the main street really of uh, Stock Newington very very busy uh, Church Street is a bit chilled so it's a high road as well uh, but here is where you get all the shops and uh, everything big businesses and things so guys yeah I'm gonna end this vlog here Hope you enjoy the uh, tour of Stock Newington. This is not the whole Stock Newington, just bits of it. 
but yeah so we walk from uh, Newington Green up the Green Lane and then uh, Clisso Park uh, all the way via Church Street to stop Newington uh, High Road, Main Road okay yeah so hope you enjoyed it and i'll see you in the next vlog bye bye gonna grab me a little drink see ya ciao